so today I am sitting down and talking to you guys to film a haul, which I feel like I haven't filmed in forever. A majority of these things are from today, but there are a few things that I want to show you guys that I've kind of just kept together that was new. I mean, I've worn some of it, but at the same time, like, it's still new because I've only worn it once or twice. But I'm going to start with the places that I only got, like, one or two things from there, and then I will get into the places that I got more than two things from there. So the first place I'm going to show you guys is Michael's because I literally got one thing from there. I actually got more than that but I only have one thing to show you and it is this really cute um, kind of like tribal print bandana and I was just looking at the bandanas and this was the cutest one and I wanted a bandana so I got a bandana. And next I went to Forever 21. I actually didn't buy this. My sister bought this for herself and then it was too small so she gave it to me and it's a really really cute pajama set. So, the shorts are probably my favorite part about it because they're like these frilly little shorts and they have little um, clouds and raindrops and umbrellas on them. And they're super duper cute. And then the top just is just gray with like the corresponding blue color to that. And it says, this is my lazy day shirt. And I would actually, like this shirt is really cute and it actually looks okay if you wear it with jeans. I almost wore it to school one day, but it was kind of wrinkly from the night before. So, I was just like, okay, never mind. The next place I went to was Victoria's Secret Pink and I just got this one really cute swimsuit top and I posted this on Instagram uh, and like with a few other things that I got but I just decided to show this to you guys from that post because I have not worn it yet and I know that a lot of you guys don't follow me on there and it's just super duper cute but it says, yeah. it doesn't say what it is. But this was $46.95 if you were wondering. Next I went to Woods and Water and this shirt actually has a stain on it. Or not a stain but like a little some boot on it. So no big deal. But I just got this t-shirt um, that I've been wanting for a while. It's just plain on the front and then it has the Patagonia symbol on the back. Because it's obviously a Patagonia t-shirt. The next place I went to was Sephora and I only got one thing from here. And it is just the um, Smith's Ro Rosebud Salve because everybody talks about this on YouTube and I've never tried it before so I was just like sure. And this is like the one that's like for any part of your body that have ones that are just lip balms. But I wanted to try this one because I mean if I just feel dry somewhere besides my lips then I'm going to use this and see how it works. And this was only $6 which is not bad at all. It smells really weird. It kind of smells like roses, but then it smells like lip balm at the same time. It basically just smells like flowers. And it says, this is the original and only rose and salve and made... Wait, what? Oh, I guess the other ones are like rosebud lip balms. Because it says, like, this is the only. Uh. So, I don't really know. Um, and it says, and maybe used as an all-purpose skin preparation. The next place I went to was Target. And I got... A purse. So a lot of you guys know that I've been carrying this Michael Kors around, but I didn't do it once in my purse with that, but um, because like literally there was like my wallet, my phone, and a few pens and pencils, and maybe like a pair of headphones because it literally fits nothing. So I decided that I would switch into a bigger kind of purse, and this is, like I said, from Target, and it's super duper cute. I love it, and I carry it by like the crossbody one like this, and if you want a what's in my purse, just thumbs up this video and I will definitely do that because this has a ton more in it so it would actually be longer than three minutes long. This was originally $30 but at Target there was like this like little sign that you could like text a number to a number and it gave you $5 off of like um something in like the I think in like the fashion or the purses or the scarves or whatever it like had like certain guidelines that you had to go by but it took $5 off of this so it made it $25 so sure I mean why not and it's really really cute they had this one a brown one and then kind of like a grayish purple one but I just decided to get this one because I thought it was the prettiest I was torn between it and the brown but then I decided that this one looked more expensive compared to the brown because the brown was kind of like a cheap looking Claire's brown if you understand what I'm saying then from Target I just got three more little things I just got some gum and then I got the this Essie nail polish that I've actually had before but it's so thick right like by now because I've used it so much and like Essie nail polishes I feel like get old faster than a lot of other nail polishes and then I also got the um, Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Eraser Dark Circles Treatment Concealer and I really don't have, have that bad of dark circles but I tried my friend's Addie's actually the first person that I posted a video with um, as my last video and I really really liked it the only thing that I wish 
wish, like, if I buy this again, I will get a lighter color because this one's closer to my all-around skin tone, but I'll be able to use this one more in the summertime for under my eyes to kind of brighten them up. So the next place I went to was the place that my sister works, and I will have the website linked down below. It's called Generation, and I don't know what the website's called, but like I said, I'll have it down below. And this is what the bag looks like. It's really, really cute and cheetah. So I just got two tops from there, and then um, I got these really good smelling little Scentsy Wax thingies, or whatever you want to call them, they're not the Scentsy brand, it's Break Apart Herbal, Herbal Melt, and this scent is called Petals of Paradise, and I think that these are so cute and like different because they actually have like things in them, and then they also have ones that are like swirly, like they have like drizzle ones, and they all smell super duper good. This is $7, I don't think that she sells this on her website, I think she only sells like clothing items on her website, but if you can order it from this like, um, brand, then I would definitely recommend it because they smell super duper good. My sister and me like this one and we like one that's called um, Summer, Rain. Summer Rain and it's actually and it's blue. So if you guys want to just take my word for it and order it, then it smells really good, I promise. So like I said, I got two shirts and this one you've probably seen on my Instagram. It is just this faux type flannel thing, like it doesn't button up or anything. And it's a high-low top with it um, already like buttoned or whatever, cuffed, whatever you want to call it. And it's just a v-neck and it's super duper cute and I love it. Um, it's like a weird stretchy, like kind of like almost spandex material. It's poly, it's 92% polyester and 8% spandex. So it's really stretchy. I love it. And I've worn it a lot with just like casual outfits with leggings, with like these little like printed pants that I have with jeans. Really, you can wear it with whatever. And this will still work. To me, this will still work in the summertime. It was like one of their like wintertime things that I would just got like the last one of like literally like a week ago but I think that you could still wear it in the summertime so and then the other shirt that I got is really really wrinkly but it looks like this it's super duper cute also they have a Instagram it's called generation it's at generation boutique and you can see me wearing this because I modeled it for them they have this blue one a peach one and a white one but this one just looked the best on me so I decided I would buy it so the next place I went to was Bath and Body Works and I basically went in there and me and my sister got obsessed with one scent so I got a lot of one scent but the first thing I got are these super duper cute um, Bath and Body Works Shea Infused Lounge Socks and it says you're the pineapple of my eye and they're just so cute it's got a little pineapple on them with sunglasses and she said that these were good up to 25 it says shea butter should last up to 25 wash washes and then the next thing i got is the honolulu sun rim spray and this is the scent that i am obsessed with now it basically smells like the beach so the water the sand and sunscreen all in one and just like the ocean air and i love it you guys should definitely go smell it if you love the smell of the beach because i know that i do and also they were having a three for eight deal where you could like mix and match things so you could get a hand cream a body lotion a body gel um a body spray or a little mini candle so i got the honolulu sun nourishing hand cream which like i said smells amazing the honolulu sun bath and body works little mini scented candle oh and here's a here's a little description of it it says Enjoy the warmth and wonder of Honolulu sunshine and a happy blend of fresh island coconut, Pacific palm, and sweet island nectar. So, if you know what any of that means, there you go. And then I also got the Oahu, Oahu Coconut Sunset um, Shea and Vitamin E Body Lotion. And this smells like, when you put it on your skin, it smells like flowers and fruit and self-tanner. The next place that I went to was Journeys and I went in there wanting to get some high top Converse but then after I tried them on I just felt like they were awkward on me. So I ended up getting, well first I got these socks which are just the no-show black socks that have like the little grip on the heel so they won't fall off. And then I ended up just getting some regular Converse that are these white ones. And they're super duper cute, and I cannot wait to wear them with everything. Even though they're probably going to get really dirty. But these are going to look really good in the summertime when you're, like, tan. Because you're just going to have, like, really tan legs and then some white shoes. And I just think that it's going to look so good, and I'm ready to wear them. And the last place I went to for this haul is Charlotte Russe. And this is probably where I'm most happy with 
my purchase because I got some cute clothes and I got these high waisted shorts that are just like an American flag but they're not like colored so I really really like them and the bag just looks like that um these are it says these were $24.99 and these are these are it says they're boyfriend shorts which is really weird because they actually fit me really really good but they weren't like too tight so I understand I think because I think they're like since they're looser they're boyfriend shorts I really don't know and then I got this just cute little gray crop top that just I can wear with anything um looks like this and this was only $8.99 so I was just like why not and last but not least I got the cutest jeans in the world they're kind of like they're the skin tight legging ones and they are so soft um okay I really don't know if they're supposed to be kind of high waisted but like if you look at it like who's waist goes from there and then like whose crotch is this far down so I'm pretty sure they're supposed to be a little bit high waisted um because that's how they were on me and they're so cute I love them they're just kind of like distressed and ripped to the bottom and I just love like the light wash of them so I cannot wait to wear them but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you want to see more hauls then comment down below or comment down below just random video ideas that you have for me and thumbs up this video if you enjoyed and you would like to see a what's in my purse video. Um, I love you guys so, 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 so much. Bye.